Hi, everyone, and welcome back to JSA TV and JSA Podcast, where we're coming to you today live from the floor of ITW 2024 here in National Harbor, uh, just outside of D.C. And I'm Barb Mitchell from JSA, and I'm joined by Andrew Lindsay, who's the CEO and co-founder of FlexNode. Tell us a little bit about FlexNode, if you if you wouldn't mind. Absolutely, and, and thanks for having me, Barb. Yeah. Um, FlexNode really aims to be a, a universal building platform that operates somewhere halfway between what you're looking at today is this ultra scale, you know, giant traditional data center and the small container. Um, and the focus really was bringing back flexibility where we've, where we've seen a lot less of it in the containerized world and, and adding that adaptability to the traditional data center where we see so many challenges happening today. Yeah. And, and so a lot of, I mean, it's amazing given the, the, demand uh, for building and deploying um, critical infrastructure. It's amazing that you're calling that need or answering that call. Uh, and, and so let's talk a little bit about an important piece of that, which of course is sustainability. And how does that build into factor into some of the work that you're doing? That's a really great question, Barb. So, you know, there's, there's two parts to really how we look at sustainability the, the first part is what technologies we effectively allow to operate within flex nodes. And, and what, what I mean by that is really focusing on liquid cooling and bringing that power efficiency into a facility that is truly designed for liquid cooling. So that's, that's on the one side. The other side is providing a way to facilitate for the built environment a much more ac accurate method of recording where the materials came from, where they were fabricated, how they were transported between different locations, so you actually know what that embodied carbon footprint looks like, yeah. um, where it's such a difficult thing to do today in the architecture, engineering, construction world. Yeah, it, it, it's such an important topic. You know, I mean, here at JSA, we... We love to be part of the conversations around that. We obviously are going to want to talk more about that with you as the, as the years go on. But let's talk now, step back a little bit in terms of the, the complexity and the differing needs of all of these um, folks that you're working with and how that leads to the need for a real customized solution. Yeah, absolutely. So, you know, with, with what we're doing now, we found that the types of liquid cooling solutions that are going into these data centers are very much tuned for the customers that are using them. And so you can have a huge variety between one customer, another, and the following where we want to be able to get, give that personalization back to a customer from the ground up. Yeah. So what we're seeing is really also not only the, the types of solutions they're using in the data center, but also the workloads that they're trying to deploy. You know, some workloads, they're much more comfortable going into those remote locations where others, because of the security, because of the proprietary requirements, they really can't have it off-prem. And so we, we want to make sure that we facilitate that also in a way that captures the hybrid market. Hmm. So for, we're still in day one here of ITW, and obviously you have lots of things in motion. What, what are you sort of hoping most to get out of the rest of this week? Yeah, I think for us, it's really about collaboration. Um, we find that we have the most value when we're working with other groups that, you know, are willing to use our tools and we're willing to use their their performance um, goals to help each other in getting ahead of this delivery problem. Yeah. Our big focus with FlexNode is, is speed. And we want to be able to enable that speed for others, not just for ourselves. Yeah. Amazing. Thank you so much. It's always It always feels like there's so much more, you know, for us to chat through. We really look forward to the, the next time we get to have this Absolutely. conversation. Uh, and in the meantime, enjoy the rest of the week here. Thank you very at much, Barb. IGW. We appreciate your time during this busy week. And thank you to our viewers for tuning in to JSA TV and JSA Podcasts. Until next time, happy networking.